Kiara Mulovinaka, have you come across some claims on the internet about injuries or deaths from the COVID-19 vaccine? Fair enough to be alarmed at first glance. But like a lot of things online, those numbers don't tell the whole story. The first thing to know is that many countries have an agency that monitors reports of all vaccine side effects. These reports are called adverse events following immunization. You don't have to be a doctor or another health worker to file one. Absolutely anyone can fill out a form and report a reaction. And here's the disclaimer. You can report a reaction to a vaccine without being sure if it was the vaccine that caused that. Some reports can be for really serious things like a blood clot or a heart problem. Other reports might be for side effects that are expected and normal but worrying for the average person. That includes things like headache, dizziness, nausea, fever or pain at the injection site. Again, people reporting any of these things don't have to be certain that the vaccine caused it. Here's a real-life example. Back in 2004, a doctor in the US submitted a report to the monitoring agency there, known as VAERS, claiming that a vaccine had turned him into the Incredible Hulk. Of course, he didn't turn into the Hulk, but he did this to show people they should treat these reports with caution. These reporting systems are important because they can pick up rare side effects of vaccinations. But reports of serious reactions go through a rigorous check by actual medical experts before a link to the vaccine is ruled in or out. Until that happens, treat these reports as what they are, unverified unchecked and unproven. The whole truth about the COVID-19 vaccine is a series from staff made in partnership with Modi Television and the Pacific Media Network.